uh, as we know that India is known for spices from the old era and uh, India has been the home of spices and looking to this situation now two institutions under ICR are working on spices one is located ISR is located at Calicut and another institute on seed spices is located in which I am heading that institute is located at Azmir that is National Research Centre on Seed Spices and at NRCSS Azmir we are working mainly on cumin, coriander, fennel, fenugreek, aswine, dill, anise and uh, nigella, uh, celery and carave. So as far as these seed spice crops are concerned, uh, India is the largest producer in the world and we have the largest area. La highest consumption around 90% domestic consumption is there and with 10% export just with 10% export we are meeting out around 50 to 60% of the world demand of these kind of seed spices and uh, the positive sign is that uh, three years back the export of cumin was uh, just worth of 32,000 metric tons with a value foreign exchange value of around 395 crore rupees whereas this year it has gone uh, one lakh, uh, more than 1,55,000 metric tons and it has given around 1,850 crores uh, of rupees in terms of foreign exchange and uh, my institute uh, in RCSS Azmir is working on uh, various aspects of improvement and growth of the seed spices, development of new varieties, high yielding varieties, disease resistant varieties and also the plant protection measures and uh, also the organic modules, protected cultivation modules and also the on-farm value addition and processing of the seed spices. So in these fields uh, the institute is working and also the quality seed production aspect is very strong and training aspect HRD this is also a very strong aspect uh, with the NRCSS. As far as uh, this uh, my institute is uh, concerned about the technologies is concerned we have given uh, several varieties in all major and minor seed spice crops and uh, the one variety I would like to mention, Azmir Coriander 1, is going to be a boon for the farmers uh, in the Hardoti region of Rajasthan and adjoining parts of MP since this variety is uh, resistant to stem gall which is a devastating disease for the last two years because of unseasonal rains and it is uh, spread by three way soil bond, seed bond and also up to some extent air bond when the conditions are favorable. So we are very much concerned about the farmers and about the, uh, the development of seed spices in the country.